Mr. Harris. Hi, hi, it's, it's, it's Ian from Jane J. Brooker's farm. Yeah, yeah, how you doing? Oh, me, I, I'm great, man, I can't complain, man. So, um, I'm just here looking at the numbers. Did you see him? Uh huh, yeah, see, I told you they'll go up. I, I know, I know it was your wife's call, that's okay, but look how much that call cost you. What if I was to tell you I had another one? Would you jump on it? I, I swear, man, the exact same thing. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, my man. 10? Oh, okay, Mr. Harris, hey, you the man. No, 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 you the man. <laughs> okay, all right, I'll talk to you soon. I'm so happy about. Hey, man, I got the Harrison account. Yeah? Yeah, man. How much? 10. 10? Oh, shit. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Shit, man. Thank you, thank you. Hey, buy a new suit. Oh, come on, man. I just got the Harrison account. <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah. You know, I'm trying to make all that money. Right. Yeah, nah. Not busy. Okay, okay, cool. Yeah, let's do that. Make sure the numbers are right. Okay. What's happening, bro? Hey, Tony. Uh, new kid in. He's doing very well. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. You know, it's been a long time since we had a promotion. Yeah, it's been kind of a tough year for these candidates, man. And as you know, it's a lot of money to be made. So we need to make it. We need to put it in my hands. Okay? So what do you think? Want to take him to Nick? That's exactly what I wanted to do. I thought you said he's an ass kisser. He's a money maker. He can kiss ass all he want. He can kiss your ass if you want to. As long as you put money in my hands, you feel me? Are you sure? God damn it, Tony. Is that what I said? You always question me. You will never be me. Do you understand? I don't kiss ass. That's not right. I'm not gonna be you. I don't kiss tell ass. Me, tell me, tell me, tell me. Do you want to work here? Because we can step outside, I will fuck you up, all right? <laughs> yeah. Got a dick. But before you go, remember, I will fuck you up. <laughs> fuck out my office. This motherfucker then lost his motherfucking mind. Hey, Ian. What's up? Tony wants to see you. Did you say what about? No. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I got the Harris account earlier, so uh, I don't know. Might want me to make partner or something, you know. Hey, yeah, we, we got to get going. Oh, right this moment? Right now. Oh, okay. Listen, the higher-ups want to see you. I put in a good word for you, and it looks like some things are happening. Uh, bro, man, I can't, man. This is, this is awesome, Just man. don't make me look bad, all right? There's an opportunity to make a lot of money. You like money, right? No, 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 I don't like money. Look, I love money, okay? <laughs> Do my gratitude for this. I don't even know what to say. Let's go get yourself ready. Go fix your tie. Go go meet him in the conference room, right? So, Nikki, when are we gonna go somewhere and do something? I'm bored. Actually, I'm, I'm going on a retreat with some of my associates. Um, very soon, I'm gonna take you with me. I'm gonna tell you that. Really? Yeah. So we're really gonna go somewhere this time? Really? Yeah. You're not afraid of anybody seeing us? I'm not worried about anything, okay, honey? You're with me now, okay? Hmm. Well, you know this is your business, and... I know. All these people work for you? That was before. You're with me. It's, 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 uh, it's cool now, right? Great. So I need to go shopping. Here, uh, here is that enough? Hmm? This will do just fine. 
So, how am I gonna get to the mall? I get your car. I can drive myself. You know how to drive, really? I do. Uh, I need you alive, okay? I'm gonna get your car, okay? Well, that's with the car. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's a couple cars. Why don't you, why don't you can maybe take a take the bus and buy two outfits? I'm kidding. <laughs> huh? You like him? You like him? Ian, we've been watching you, and um, a very long time. To start a successful business, doing some good a very work. successful business. Amazing work, actually. You need, when you say you need many things, I mean, there's intangibles. Yeah, we've been very impressed. <laughs> Thank you, sir. <laughs> it, it, that means a lot to me. Um, uh, the fellows and I have been working here in this firm together for, oh, just some time now. To start a successful business, a very successful business, you need, you need many things. I mean, there's intangibles, et cetera. But every enterprise, big enterprise, has one thing in common, one common denominator, and that is teamwork. What do you think, Ian? Would you agree with that? Yes, of course. Yes, sir. I agree with everything you just said 100%. As a matter of fact, I agree with everything you said 110%. <laughs> you can't do anything 110%. You can only do 100%. And I want your best 100%, okay? So, what was I? Company teamwork, um, I didn't make a lot of money. How do, I was talking about money. I'm, I'm, I'm always talking about money, actually. <laughs> money or pussy. So how do you make a lot of money? How do we make a lot of money? More, uh, to, the, more to the point. How do we make a lot of, how do we make a lot of money? Company pin right? He's did, did, did he say that? that that's some racist shit. What did he, he say? He said picnics. You talking about black people? Yeah, that's what I'm you talking about, He's black. He's black. black. I'm black. Yeah, come on. Just but picnics? Is, 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 hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. <laughs> did he say picnics, really? <laughs> Fuck you, you did not. <laughs> if we take the gloves off in here, this is how we are upstairs. Okay, you assholes now, so you gotta work. <laughs> we, up here, we, we, we up here kicking it, making and counting money. <laughs> we, take, we take the gloves off up here, baby. <laughs> the bitches, well, the bitches. Uh, I'm just joking. Anyway, I mean, what do you think, what do you think these presidents are doing Friday night? I, I gotta, I, I'll tell you. Bonding. Bonding, I was gonna say bonding. Teamwork. How do teams get to, how do you become a team? You bond. UCLA's great teams in the in the 80s, the 70s, 70s. Teamwork. Lou Elsinder, then Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, Bill Walton, Greg Lee, Marcus Johnson, Walt Hazard, Gail Goodrich, John Wooden was the key. He made them play as a team. The Bulls. Yeah, they had Mike. You gotta have, you gotta have, you have a go-to guy to, to win a championship, but they were a team. Steve Kerr won a championship. So did Jim Paxson. The team. Michael Jordan doesn't win anything without a team. Yeah, Mike wasn't shit until, until Scottie Pippen. Scottie Pippen. I said that already. Yeah. Everybody, everybody's in tech, but that's what the team is. You're right, Nick. You're right, Nick. I see what you're doing. Okay, Nick, so, go yeah, ahead. Yeah. Let's, 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 we're going to pause now. We're going to pause now. We're going to pause. We want to pause? Yeah. Okay. Well, one of our partners here thinks you're a bit nervous. Do you think, do you feel a bit nervous? No, sir, not at all. It's okay. Listen, honesty is real men aren't afraid of the truth. No, no, sir. I, I've hit a deer before, you know. <laughs> you know, just random smooth over. No, just well, nervous, I, nervous in this interview. Uh, no, no, no. No, not at all. Not at all. Not nervous at all. I'm not sure if you're nervous or an ass kisser or a nervous ass kisser. <laughs> <laughs> but one thing I do know is you're willing to learn. If you want to play hard and learn, Listen, you can get better, you can improve. We're not the NBA. You gotta be great, you have to have gifts. In business, you can learn. We fuck people up. We want our competitors to go home and cry. We want to destroy their will. Go home and go, I don't feel like it, baby. I just lost $200 million. <laughs> that would fuck me up. <laughs> <laughs> Bottom line, and are you in? Me, you guys want to invite me? This is the next phase, baby. Yes, of course. Okay, of course. come down here and shake our hands. Come on. Yeah, fuck yeah. Thank you, guys. I, I appreciate it.
you know, I stand up, but I'm kind of ashamed I have on jeans. <laughs> I, I did this interview with you. Oh, whatever. <laughs> hey, you do whatever you want, sir. Thank you. When I got back from the tech convention, she wasn't at the airport to pick me up. Her friends didn't know where she was at and neither did her parents. That's when we filed the report. Can you provide any contact information of the friends you travel with? Sure, if you think that's going to help. Just covering the bases. If there's anything else I can do to help, please just let me know and I'll do it. Just want her home safe. I miss her. You're doing fine. Just keep passing out flyers and getting out the information. That's the best way you can help. All right, uh, just one more question. The night you left, what was your fight about? Fight? Yeah. One of our friends, um... Stephanie Miller. Yeah, said you got, they went out to dinner because you guys had a fight. What was that about? No, it was a, it was a stupid fight. She was upset that I went to the tech convention. She wanted to go to a concert to see some band. I went to the convention for work, not for fun. Our argument had no malice in it. It was just a stupid fight. Oh, shit. Your mom again? Yeah. Uh, see you in the car. Hey, Mom. Hey, baby. How you doing? I'm, I'm good, Mom. I'm just working. Good. Tell me, have you found those missing people yet? Uh, no, Mom, but we will. Don't worry. That's good. I'm not worried. Have you talked to your brother lately? Uh, no, Mom, but, but I will, Mom. Call your brother. I don't want you two to be distant and not know each other. I just don't understand how people can be that way. Treat family like that. Okay, Mom. All right, I, I, I gotta go, Mom. I'm, I'm working. I love you. Oh, 
All right, man. Hey. Just here, chill. Man. Just gonna chill. But make sure you just listen to everything they say. All right. All right, all right, man. Right, this is this mix right here. Yeah, man. Check it out. Ooh. This is not boat. I even called some broads for you. I know you like black girls, right? Hell yeah. I man. do too. <laughs> Hell yeah. Man. Put that stuff up in here. Hey, don't be kissing no ass though. No ass. No all ass right? kissing. All right, here we go. No ass kissing. Don't spot, right? I mean, is, is this. Hey, Tony, man, be honest with me. That wasn't too much to the office, right? I mean, I don't want to disrespect nobody. I don't want to make nobody, Dude, nobody mad, man. Chill, I just, I just chill. Want to in, man. I just, chill, bro. Okay. Chill. Okay, yeah. It's I'm, all good. I'm, I'm chill. I'm good. Don't worry, man. I got you, man. Okay. I want you to fit in. Just have a good time. I'm Absolutely. drunk. I'm going to smoke. I got some bitches lined up. Let's got some bitches some lined up? Hell yeah. I know you, you like bitches, right? Yeah. You ain't gay? Man, what kind of bitches? You're not gay? F fuck no. Stop that, dude. Come on. I like bitches, man. All right. Okay, what, what kind of bitches? Like, I, I mean, you know, myself, I like titties. Big ass chocolate titties, man. I just want titties like, I just turn my face up. Yeah, man. Just don't be kissing anyone. All right, man. Come on. All right. All right. Come on. I mean, this is really cool, like, you know? Yeah, <laughs> man. All right. Just chill, have a good time, relax. Rolling. So, man, where are you going to teach me how to shoot your gun? Teach you how to shoot? Yeah. Jesus. How about I plan a trip and I teach all you ladies how to shoot? How about that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, if you're not going to teach me how to shoot, I think we all need to take shots. Right. Shots. 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 Bring me one. Bring me one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, Tony. Where's Nick? Nick who? He passed out like 10 minutes ago. I'm going to need like 10 shots. <laughs> <laughs> passed out like that? <laughs> Please. I'm gonna need you to pass me out. You do that? I guess. Yeah, you guess. Click that. All right. Click that. Get it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey, I gotta be honest with you, fellas. I've never, never, ever experienced anything like this before. Oh, what's the matter? Your girlfriend don't let you party? Hey, tonight he doesn't have a girlfriend. Well, you're his girlfriend. You could be his girlfriend. I'll just go buy a new one. <laughs> Wait a minute now. I just brought my girls here to have a good time. We just trying to party. So, since I'm your girlfriend now, I'm gonna insist that you have a good time. So, go ahead and drink this shot. Man up. Shit, I guess you only live once, That's right? That's right. <laughs> <laughs> So good, I have to tie you up.
Which way? 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 Which way?
ballsy motherfucker, huh? Look, man, he doesn't have a warrant, okay? And he'd rather never ever talk to me again and go forward with this. Look, if he does call back, just let me know. I mean, they're all small-time losers paid by money order or whatnot. So there's no trail. Don't worry about it. So we're good? Yeah. Beautiful. It's all good, man. Eddie! Hey, Mateo. Steady Eddie. <laughs> man. Come here. Hey, man. Yeah. That was... That was... You. <laughs> I, I, we got you. lucky. Hey, I don't know, man. That was all you right there. <laughs> I was, was just doing my job. Was. It was. Man. We got lucky. We got lucky. No, nah, bro. I saw you right there. That's <sighs> all you. You're welcome. You're welcome. But we got lucky. We can't expect that kind of turnaround. Okay. But we got it. So we're going to use it. We're going to go long term. Okay. We're going to put some money right back into your pocket. All right? And then I'm going to take the bulk of it. I'm going to reinvest it. Listen, we made a lot of money last time. Yeah. All right? A lot. So whatever it is you want me to do, I'm in. All right? All right. So just tell me what you need me to do, and this, we're in. Let's this is it. what I needed from you. Okay. I needed the face to face. Now I go back in, and I take care of all of it. Okay. I just needed the OK from you. Hate to cut it short, but daddy duty calls. I understand. Before I go, you want anything to eat? No, Coffee? I'm good. You sure? I got a drink. You sure? Yeah. All right, my man. Thank you so much, bro. You're welcome. I'll You're see welcome. you next time. You will. All right. Say hi. Say hi. Hi. See you. Hey. Right. See you later. That's daddy's friend right there. <laughs> best friend. Make us rich. Do my best. I'll do my best. <sighs> It happened last night. He's in with the sketch artist right now. I'm Special Agent Collins, and this is Special Agent McBride with the FBI Missing Persons. I would like to talk to you about what happened. Now? Just about done. That's him! That's the motherfucker that jumped me! He jumped me from behind! Okay, Mr. Monroe, you wanna... Start from the top. Tell me what happened. Well, I was leaving work. And then I lit me a cigarette. I started my car first, and I lit a cigarette. And I heard a noise over by the garbage cans. And I walked over to see what was going on. But I didn't see anything. So as I turned around, he jumped me from behind. copyright match on the tattoos. It's an artist from Fuentes County. I want you to get in touch with the local sheriff department let him know we're on our way. What is it, a six hour drive? Four and a half. Did good, Mr. Monroe. This is a big breaking up investigation. You did real good, man. Real good. Can I go home to my family now? No, no, I believe in this company. Listen, the market's clear, their patents are in, good, bringing this only to my best customers. You're number three for the day. We can start out small if you want. Okay. Okay. No. I'll send it over to you. Yeah. Oh no. This is, this is gonna be great. Alright, thank you. Alright, bye Bob. Hey, my man. Look at you, man. I don't know how you do it. <laughs> I just sell it to him straight, man. You know, that's funny because usually our business runs on bullshitting as much as possible. Uh, I, I don't know what to say. I guess I got the magic touch. Yeah, yeah, that's good, man. Hey, you keep it up, okay? You're doing a great job, Ed. Hey, um, listen. So, um, I'm about to go talk to the big boys upstairs. And, uh, usually we go on these vacations, hunting trips, you know, and uh, I want to see if you're okay with going with us. I mean, I'm not really much of a hunter. Hey, hey, bro, look, I understand, okay? Neither was I. I mean, look at me, right? <laughs> There's really not much to it, you know, but I'm telling you, man, 
you get in good with these guys on that level, it'll do wonders for your career. I'm talking about major money, okay? All right, man, so how's that sound, man? You I'll run up by my wife and get back to you after lunch. Talk to the wife. Hey, man, talk to the wife. Let me know. I'll go upstairs and talk to him. Okay. All right, man, I'll put All in a right. good word for you. Thank Keep you. Keep the good word. All right. Look, I understand. I don't care about his kids. Fire. Okay? What do you think of that new guy? Nice guy. Smart. I think he can make us a lot of money. Well, any of these guys can make us a lot of money. It makes them different. Like I see it in his eyes. Kind of like you. How so? Sometimes you just know. Good job with this. What makes him like me? He's ambitious. He's smart. And it's a killer inside. Well, where is he now? As a matter of fact, he's uh, with Ian right now. So catch up with him. You can go. All right. William, where you at? I got groceries. Edward! Hey. Look at you. How you doing, pal? I'm good. How about yourself? Oh, I'm strong as an actor. Do not let the limp fool you. <laughs> I believe it. You, you can talk to the oh. pal. How's Kelly doing? She's doing good. Now the new place. Getting territorial with the cats. Uh, <laughs> sounds about right. Hey, listen. I appreciate you not telling her about this. It's all right. It really is. Good. Oh, uh, Ed. I just. I'm really sorry. I wish I wasn't hurt. I've worked for 40 years and here I am. This is how they treat me. My own son in law, you know, sneaking me money. I don't deserve this. I don't deserve you, Ed. <laughs> it's okay. It really is. Your family. Oh, dude, give me a hug. Good cat. Let's end this room, let's. Amagashi, I got your stuff right over here, man. Yeah, I got it right here. All your bodies, man. So, what do you guys need so many bodies for? I do not talk to you, okay? You talk to me, listen, man. listen to me. You stop right now, okay? I don't want to talk to a helper. Helper. Answer my question. How many American bodies do you have? Hey, man, I'm the one that gets you these bodies. As many as you want, I got them. Male, female. <laughs> I know what you like with those females, hey, too, man. Are they all in this hoary shape? They're in great shape. So Fresh. unprofessional. You put in the trash bag, put in the other clothes. Yeah, you know, Please. it's just, it's in here. It's quick. All the other ones are nice. Nice wrap tight. Right now, I need the numbers. How many American body can you buy? 50, 75, 100. I don't buy them. I get them for you, man. I'll get okay. you all. Okay, okay, okay. I talk to your boss. I do not talk to you, okay? You go talk to boss, get him in here, me and him, we can negotiate. Go get your boss. All right. Are you man. talking? Yeah, all right, whatever. Let me go get the boss, man. He'll talk to you. I'll get the boss. Business is good, huh? Business is good. I have a 40 trucks. I have so distributorship. None of my checks bounce. I work hard. I work very hard. But I need consistent supply. I need quality. So quality was good last time, right? I'm hoping on our next shipment we get a lower price point. 
lower in number. Quality should reflect the price, no? Absolutely. Mm. So I give you good quality, you give me good price. Human body should not be that expensive. I beg to differ. I put in a lot of work. Mm. And the human body never goes out of style. Mm -hmm. I like to be consistent and I like to be royal. So uh, we, we look forward to doing more business, okay? I like loyalty too. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm. Okay. Good. Cheers. Mm -hmm. I am the last one out of the office again. Kelly's gonna kill me by the time I get home. Oh. Snuggle up on the couch, fall asleep. That's exactly what I'm saying. Wait, hold up a second. Edward! Oh, hey, Mr. MacArthur. Got a minute? Uh, sure, yeah. Meet me for a drink. Yes, yeah, sure. So, Edward, do you shoot? No, played some paintball. Well, Ian comes to me. And he tells me that you were interested in our hunting trip. Um, Drink. Thank you. Um, Mr. MacArthur, could I ask you a question? Yeah, shoot. Sure. Are you married? Depends on the city and state. But yeah, I am. Why do you ask? Do you have any kids? Kids. Do I have kids? No, I don't. But what does that have to do with this trip? Uh, it's just been on my mind a lot recently. Um, you know, whether I'd be a good dad, be able to provide for my family. Look, you do very well for yourself, Edward. 28 years old, making a lot of money. You know, you, you do good, good for yourself. Do all right. How much do you make, actually? Um, well, I haven't even been here quite a year, but I think I'm at 83, 84. So you don't do that well. Okay, how would you like to double your money? Yeah, we could absolutely double it. It sounds amazing. Look, when you go on this hair camping trip, we camp, we hunt, we bond. That's what we do. If you're interested in making more money, I can help with that. Nick can help with that. All right. There's a lot of money to be made. Let's go make some money. A hunter. It's what I told Ian. But he insisted. These are my bosses. What was I supposed to say? Try no. Could you just support me on this one? Just a little bit, please. Just this one. Okay. If I were to come home tomorrow and tell you that I was going on vacation with a bunch of my friends to kill animals, you would be okay with that. I'm not going to kill any animals. I'm just going along for the beer and the laughs. Have a good time. It's a one-time thing. This is not okay. It's easy for you to say. It's not your job on the line. You did not just fucking say that. I'm the only one with a job right now. I'm the only one bringing in money. We're trying to keep this roof over our head. We just bought this house. Hello. Hey, William. It's, it's Ed. Um, am I bugging you? Nah, not at all. Just eating chips. What is it, big guy? I just... I really need someone to talk to. Ed, you were saying something about a hunting trip? Yeah. It's for work, but... 
If it makes her this angry, maybe I just I shouldn't go. Right. Well, if it's for work, or would you get fired if you didn't go? No, no, that's not it. It's just, it's my one chance to get into this inner circle. To, to make something for myself there, to be successful for her. Listen, if you need to stop helping me. No, no, that's not it. I should be able to support my family. I should be able to take them on vacations, pay for college. I just, that's not it at all. Does she know this? She might have her suspicions, but I don't want to scare her. I just bought a house. She's not working. Okay, go and get some sleep. I'll come over and talk to her. Do what you need to do. Okay. All right. Thanks, William. She might be mad now, but she loves you. It'll fade. I hope. Got a good batch here. 200 points. 500 points for them big ass titties right there. I'm getting that. I'm getting up in that. Yeah. It's a lot of money on the table. Shit. Yeah. I'm winning this. Okay. I want to win this. See, you care about points. I care about money. I need you to come in strong. You need to come in fast. You need to come in hot. You were coming in a little weak, Tony. You're thinking too much. How much is Nick giving us to win this thing? I don't know. We said something about a Ferrari. But what, what kind of motivation do you need? I want to win. Well, let's have you win. What about the new guys, Ian? Seems like it. All right. We good? Yeah. I'm losing control. Help me, God. Is it just me that sees the flames? I'm sorry about the time. I left you lonely. I'm sorry about the time when you wanted to hold me. I'm sorry about the time that I didn't even give you cause it's gone, all gone. I know. We got no idea. Help! 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 Stop! Help! Stop yelling! Help Stop! We don't know where we are, just like you. And nobody's out there trying to find us. So what's the point? So shut the fuck up already, eh? Hey, she doesn't even know what's going on! Don't give a fuck it. Come on, stop cussing. Who are you people? Why are they doing this? We have no idea, okay? We're in the same boat as you. We were kidnapped. This can't be happening. What's your name? What's your name? Uh, Maggie. Maggie, I'm Cynthia. Maggie, why don't you do me a favor and tell us what the last thing you remember before waking up is? Uh, yeah. I was, I was leaving work. Um, I can't. She doesn't know she has been drugged. Leave her alone. Why? I don't understand why. That's bullshit, man. Fuck. Come on with the language, please. Fuck, look how I am, bro. Check my fucking language. No way. Everything that everybody is going through here. How dare you? How long have you guys been here? 
understand that everything that you want will be shown. Sometimes I put up a dream, you dream of will become reality. Sometimes you fail, happen you had to let it be in order to see how happy and some. <laughs> Big A, what's up, man? I'm glad you could join us. Come on, what took you so long? You gotta hit the road, man. Ready? Uh, why don't you go ahead and do this? What's wrong with you? Nothing, it's just, you know, I don't like needles and blood and all of that, so, uh, I mean, you'll be all right. Fine. Let me know if you need me. And they're all crooked, like, yeah. they do. And it's obvious. Very obvious. What's going on? Uh, nothing's going on. Nothing. Um, but she knows who Chase Thomas is. He's my ex-boyfriend. I guess he's telling me you guys are looking for him. Would he be inside the tattoo parlor? Man, he's not going to be in there. No. He doesn't hang in there. I mean, there's a bar down the street. He's going to be there. That's where you'll find him. I can take you there. What's the name of the bar? Steak and Titties. <laughs> Excuse me. We're looking for a Mr. Chase Thomas. I don't know any Chase Thomas. Sorry. You don't remember me, do you? Yeah, I do. Thomas Curry. His son went missing over two and a half years ago. Never found him. I don't know any Chase. How did she know all that? I've been trying to figure that out ever since she was recruited from the academy. How are you, Miss Curry? Shit. That's how I'm doing. Like shit. Sorry about that. You guys, the FBI guys, come in here. Come here for a drink? Huh? You young lady, you come here for a drink? Or should you be out there doing your job? Doing your job looking for my son. You go to the coffee shops, you have drinks. But you're not doing your job looking for my son. It's been two fucking years. It's bullshit! Well, that's not fair. It's okay. Mr. Curry, we heard Chase in the lead. It was a kidnapping attempt. We want to stop that from ever happening again. I'm sorry about your son, but in no way have we ever given up hope of finding him. Or anyone, and we never will. That's him! What? Hey, Mr. Thomas. Put the FBI here. We need your help identifying someone who may be wearing one of your tattoos. Oh, well, that dude? Yeah, I know him. He's a ranch hand around here. I don't know which one though. There's like 30 in the area. Do you have a name? I don't. I used to just call him Pablo. That's not his real name though. I just called him that because I thought it was funny. Thank you for your help, sir. Coming. I'm just sketch to every man he's got. We need to check every ranch in the area. We also need to contact the bureau. Yo! Big bro, what's up, man? You look good. Thank you, you too. What you doing here, man? Hey, uh, you know, mom said you were supposed to call her last night. Yeah, yeah I'm working. Uh, McBride, this is my partner, McBride. My brother. Nice to meet you. I am. Uh, this is Ed, from work. Hey, hey. Ed, nice to meet you. Thanks, McBride. Hey. So you really working, man? Bust the bad guys? Ah, uh, exactly. And, uh, what are you doing here? I didn't expect to see you. What brings you here? Stay in You guys sell insurance or something? 
FBI. Pretty, big boy. This is for the fool and the women. Same as all the other girls. So, uh, what's going on between you and your brother? I noticed some tension out there. Man, we've been distant for a while now. Since high school. And I guess he's mad at me. I guess he thought I was going to be an FBI agent like him. Why would he think that? There's been cops in my family for generations. Then why aren't you one? You know how much cops make a year? Yeah. Okay. Let me tell you something, man. I like to get money, baby. Okay? Yeah. And I do whatever it takes to get that. <laughs> Shit. All right. I got a lifestyle to maintain. Can I get more, Christy? Now, how am I going to convince you to get one of these ladies, man? <laughs> come on, man. Come on, man. No, 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 no. I didn't really like him before. I like him now, but I just think he might be too much of a good guy. I think he might be right. He'll be fine. Trust me. I don't think I have to do him like he did the others, okay? Yeah? We got lucky with Ian. He's a cool dude, but the two guys before him, they were such good brokers too, you know what I mean? Both so negative, man. Come on. Look forward to tomorrow. All right? It'll be a good hunt. Do it or I'll kill you. <laughs> you sure you don't want to go with us? Yeah. I'm sure I'm going on a picnic. <laughs> no, I'm sure, man. It's a young man's game. Breaking a new kid. It'll be fun. Okay? You got it. Get the fuck out of here now. <laughs> oh, wow, look at the hose. Hell yeah. You put a nice smile like he's been on a picnic. Oh, man, let me live it down, would you, Nick? Now look forward to tomorrow. Enjoy the hunt. Okay? Be cool. I cannot believe that he actually went after that big fight we had. He is selfish. You know that's selfish. He's not selfish. He's a grown man. Him and his friends acting like big men, killing defenseless animals. It's not that serious. I've hunted before. Well, then you're sick too. Get out of my house. Hell, Belle, you need to calm down. Give him a break. He's your husband. You should have thought of that before going off to play Rambo. He's not. He just wants to be good at his new job. Yeah, let him do what he needs to do to provide for his wife and his future family. Excuse me? I'm not pregnant. Who the fuck told you I was pregnant? Um. Uh, nobody. Mm, damn, girl. You know I love you in this leather pants. Mm, well, you know mm, I wore them just for you. You said oh, you yeah. was coming back, so I had to take <laughs> care of that for you. And that's why I love vacation. Right? Damn. And it's a nice night. It's a beautiful night. Yeah, I know you're not looking at the sky though when you say it. Oh yeah, 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 you know, the sky is nice too, you know. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Hey, man, come on out here and get some of this! Oh, man. Mm. You know how it is when guys on their first time. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, I remember yeah. yours. Hey, you're outside with the others. Why not? It looks like a blast. Not really my scene. I miss my wife enough as it is. I'd rather be in here. Fair enough. Understood. <laughs> you know the usual stockbroker uh, uh, that I've come across in all my years. You, I don't know, too mild mannered. I don't know. I just see us, you know, putting people together. People need to make money. Businesses need the investment. Try not to bullshit anybody. Right. Fair enough. Hey, oh. Ed, did you call, you call your wife? Yeah, she didn't answer that. Oh, you know, you know, you don't have to come hunting tomorrow if you don't want. You know, you can always stay in here and watch TV. Thanks, but I mean, that's why I came up here, right? The bonding, the adventure, just about the hookers. What's wrong with hookers? I'm just kidding. Hmm. Look, call your wife again. 
you get her on the phone. If you don't, you know, if you don't pick up, you leave a message. It's the only advice I can give in all my years of fucking up. Yeah, cover your back. All right, I will. Thanks, Nick. Oh, hey, sure thing. Honey, it's me again. Miss you. Sorry. I'm sorry I came on this stupid trip. Sorry for the fight. It's killing me how angry you were. I love you. When I get back, we need to get away. Just you and me, away from everything. Please call me when you get this. Fucking motherfucker! The fuck you trying to do, you fucking little bitch? Man, who, who are you? Why are you here? Stop it! Stop it, you, you son of a bitch! Stop! Oh yeah, stop! You're you fucking kill you! Help! 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 Oh, you should take this long. Hey, I would have took some rubber too. <laughs> what, what you got, like uh, gonorrhea or something? Hope it's not herpes. You know, that's the gift that keeps on getting. You know? I know you got it. Huh? You got it? Looking for all the guns that I listen. Nah, man. Shoot me for a diamond. Many colors, all to find her enemy from in blood and light. To song up uh, and a secret like grow cat and love loves it from the heart of the first time love time and time again I put up a new dose just to be love language no matter Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 
that go. Give me this. So tall about, baby. Eight hundred. Eight hundred. Eight hundred. Eight hundred. Let me show you. He's still breathing. No, no, no he's okay. He's okay. Yeah. I got it. I got it. Get up. Get up. Get up. Let me show you something. Let me show you something. See, this is what we do. We go like this. Okay. Here. Take it. No, no, Take the fucking you guys, call an ambulance. You guys can't be fucking serious here. Look, take the gun. No, no, I'm not shooting anyone. Dude, this is what we're hunting, man. Come on, don't embarrass me now. Call a fucking ambulance. He's still alive. A fuck, a fucking ambulance? You guys crazy? Well, it's, it's either gonna be him or you, huh? I'm not killing anybody. You not killing anybody? No. Hey, is everything all right in here? Something, something is wrong with Edward. Yeah, what are you saying? There's something wrong. I know, I can feel Calm it. Calm down, nothing's wrong with Ed. He's going to be fine. You're just coming down from the big fight you had. It's okay. I want him here, Daddy. I don't want him to be hurt. He's fine. Everything is going to be fine. Come here. Oh, baby. Uh, so hard to be a woman. Have you seen Cynthia? No, are you all right? Yeah. How long have you been here? I don't know, I just woke up overnight. I was sleeping right over that hill over there overnight too. Are the only ones that made it? I guess, I don't know, I haven't seen anyone else. How long ago did you get out? Right after, right after Cynthia did. I haven't seen her. Come on, they gotta be around here somewhere. We gotta get going and find them. Right. You okay? Yeah. We gotta keep moving. We can't be too far from civilization, all right? Are you, do you want me to help you? No, I'm fine. What about the others? We don't even know if they're alive or not. Look, we just gotta pick a direction and go. Okay. okay, yeah, but where do we go? Oh my God. That, that's Cynthia! 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 Hey, we can't hear you! Cynthia, come here! We can't hear you! What? What is she saying? Come here! Where are you going? Cynthia! Run! Oh, my God. 
I don't. You see the gun, right? So, like a run, scream, nothing? <laughs> when my mom passed and she was on her deathbed, she mentioned something to me. She said, your life really does flash before your eyes when you're dying. And I never understood what she meant because at that moment she was still alive. But when death is coming, you start to think about all of those little moments in life. That's the flash. Plus, Jesus said in the Bible, that I should never fear the one that could kill the body because you can't destroy my soul. Instead, I should only fear the one that has the ability to destroy the mind, the bodies, and the soul. Besides, I lived a happy life. So you're not gonna run, scream or nothing? Hell, you should be the one that's afraid. Anymore. Got the bag now. It's okay. Come on, let's 
get you cleaned up. Damn. Oh, look at you in the vulgarity. Uh-huh. Hey, that's him! Freeze! Freeze! Take Look at you. Motherfucker made me run. Was it worth it, Pump? Stop huh? resisting. You know that's the button work. You wouldn't go home right back. Save their lives. Not really. I was just following you. Thought I'd go out on my own and explore a little bit. That's all I did. Hey, um. I'm sorry about your partner. Thanks. Oh. Sorry about your son. Yeah, well, at least he didn't die in vain. We stopped him. That's what's important. But they found a survivor out there. Luckily, he's a big guy. Anybody else that's 50 pounds lighter would have died out there by now. Let's go. I'm okay. I got an adult male, late 20s. He's got a gunshot wound, upper thorax, left side. ETA is about 17 minutes. Alright? Alright. Yeah, buddy, you're alive. You're alive. Yeah, you sure do, son. 